is up, brawlers, bladers, and fellow awesome nerds. I'm Baku Kid. And I am Baku Dad, and we are the Baku Boys. And if this is your first time to the channel, please... Like and subscribe. Yep, and also drop a comment so you can help keep our channel growing as we do try and release weekly Bakugan, Beyblade, and other awesome nerdy content every Wednesday, Friday, and Saturday. But with that being said... Let's go ahead and jump into what we've got in store for you guys for this video. So today, today is, is exciting. Yes, it and is. Sunday. Saturday. Um, Saturday. <laughs> I get mixed up. Yeah, that's all right. That's all right. Yes, it is Saturday, and we have like you uh, like if you guys watched our Wednesday video, uh, I did say we have something super awesome in store for you guys for this video. And ooh, I accidentally. Bump Hit it. The camera a tiny bit. Let me bring it out. Let me readjust the camera. Okay, there we go. Okay. That was a little bit weird. Because, yeah, I bumped it with the box. <laughs> but, yes, we have. We are pulling out from <laughs> our. <It's so> <laughs> well, I mean, it's so big already. Bah. Yes, this is what we've got for today's awesome unboxing video. The Bakugan Geogon Rising Geoforge Dragonoid. Baku Kid and I, we were actually so excited to, to actually get this. We had to check a couple different targets to see if they actually had it in stock. And we actually found one that had like, what was it, three? Three, yeah. Yeah. They were lucky enough to have three on the shelf. They're probably already gone. Probably. But Baku Kid and I were lucky enough to snag at least one of them. And we are so glad we did because we have been so excited about this. Ever since we ever since we actually saw anything about it, we were like, no, nah, we, we have to have the Geoforge Dragonoid. I want to hold it. Yay, it is. It's so big and it's a great hiding spot. Yes. It's so big. It is a massive box. It covers my face. <laughs> Can anyone see me? Couldn't Can see anyone. your face. Yeah. You can see my eyes, my blue eyes. <laughs> <laughs> but we're not going to waste that much more time. We're going to go straight to the table and unbox this awesome Geoforge Dragonoid. Catch you guys. It. Yep, catch you guys in just a moment. See you right back. Welcome back. Yes, welcome back to the table where we are ready to open up, wow, this huge, huge, huge box. Get started for me, please. Yep, let's go ahead and... I didn't even grab scissors or anything for this. We're just gonna... Use our fingers. We're gonna reptar. We're gonna tear this open like Godzilla versus King Kong. And I'm mega. And I'm mecha Godzilla robot. We're if just gonna ever, tear this box open. If you ever seen the movie? Roar! Yeah. And there we go. That just slid right out. <laughs> Evie touched me. Touch me. Well, that is the first time we have ever tore a box open like that, but wow. Oh, but this. We need to have this on the wall. I like this little dragonoid cutout, though. I think we should have it on the wall. Don't rip it. Don't rip it. It's so cool. Yes. The Geoforge Dragonoid right there. Looking awesome. We need to have it on the wall. <laughs> we need to have it on the wall. Now, let's just go ahead and carefully clip out each of the Geoforge Geogon. Wait, was that one, um, what was his name again? Talon. Talon. Like Wednesday. 
Mm hmm You opened up the town and he didn't have he had the white. Yep. But you figured it out? Mm-hmm. But this is a different talon. This is Geoforge okay, talon. We should bring him out? Because he's the main one? The main one? Oh yeah, because this is the true this is the, the true metal dragonoid. They actually put metal in this dragonoid and you can feel the difference and Oh my gosh, that's real metal. Mm-hmm. The big head and then the little head. And then how do you bring it out? I need to have to get the uh, Baku core. Oh. Oh, but yeah, he's got that tiny horn. Yeah. Let's, let's see if I can close him up real quick. He's got the arms. He's got the little arms like a um. Oh, I forgot to tuck in that tail. Okay, we need like a box. Wait. There's a. Yep, it comes with a gate card. We should put it on the gate card. Okay, let's go ahead and pull out each of the Geogon. I should just pop right out. Okay, I don't want to be rude, but this one kind of looks ugly. What, Montrepod, I think? He, he looks weird, and I just don't really like it. You do that side, and I do this side. I got that one out pretty easy. And there we go. I can't get them out. You can't get that one out? Yep. That is so hard. Ooh, there we go. Ooh. That is all of them. I have to get something out. Wait! This is actually going to probably be a little bit of a a little bit of a longer unboxing video, but that's because there's a lot of parts. Okay. And we're going to combine this too. Okay. So. Ooh. Okay. We don't need the, 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 the instructions on how to play, but we do need to keep those because those are the instructions on how mm -hmm. to open each one. And let's go ahead and check out these Baka cores. How to open and close. I think. Yeah, how to uh, how to close each Bakugan and also combine. So let's check out these Baka cores real quick. So we got one Flaming Fist and one Magic Shield. So for the uh, Flaming Fist, we get minus four damage. Okay, that that's a that's a trap core, and we really don't use trap cores that much. And then the magic shield, oh wow, a plus six fifty B. So the best magic uh, magic shield core you can have. So you better pick it up while it lasts. Okay. Okay, there we go. Horn. <laughs> no. He get in. Okay, there we go. I want to see the gate card. All right, let's check out the gate card that we oh, get with this. So bad. A Geoforge awesome. Dragonoid gate card. So it comes with its own special gate card, too. I really like that oh, gate card. Also, I figured this out. And these two guys. Okay, yep. So, first off, we have Geoforge, Arcleon, and come on, Eevee. Let's get off the table, girl. So, we have 
Geoforge Arcleon. Cost seven to bring him out. 2800 B, three damage, and he's got double strike. And that's that guy? Yep, that is. Yep, this is Arcleon. So if I put him in my deck, then. I don't, I, put the I don't know if you'd really want to put Arcleon in your deck, though, because he costs seven to bring out. Oh, yeah. But I'd still want the Dragonoid. Okay, Geoforge Titan King costs five energy to bring out. 2300 B, three damage. If he lands on a magic shield, he gets plus five damage. And Victor is team attack. He initiates a team attack. That's actually pretty cool. So that's with the Titan King. Even if they're closed? I don't know. I'd have to look at the ruling for that. Okay, next is Geoforge Talon. Costs five energy to bring out. 2200 B, six damage, and Victor initiates team attack. Geoforge Stingzer. Five energy to bring out, 2200B, two damage, and Victor gets to draw two, uh, the Victor draws two cards. There he is. Yep, Stingzer. Geoforge Arachnia. Six energy to bring out, 2200B, eight damage, and he gets two Frost Strike. Let's move those. And now... For Geofarge, Geoforge Montrepod, Geo, Geoforge, Geoforge <laughs> Montrepod, four energy to bring out, 1600 B, seven damage, and Victor gets to scan the top card and draw one card. Geofart. Geofarge. Fart. All right, and here are all six individual. But who are we missing? The, the six. Geogon, the six Geoforge Geogon that come with this set. And now for the headpiece itself is, well, let's tuck in the big head because he looks like he looks really funny with that big head. He so like here's Crocs. the here's the little head. This is how this is the what right way he should look. So Geoforge Dragonoid with the flaming fist and magic shield core. 900B, one damage, and if he lands on a Flaming Fist, he gets plus five damage. And bring back the head because it looks like Trox. <laughs> he looks... He looks... Sick. Der no, he looks derpy with that big head in this form. He looks really derpy. <laughs> <laughs> he looks like Trox. So, and like we said, uh, we're going to build him. Yep. It is now time to build Geoforge Dragonoid. So there is the headpiece. We need to we need to have that headpiece out. No, We're not going to even worry about closing these up right now because honestly, putting these guys together is more fun. Combining these guys right now is going to be the the awesome part. Okay, so Arcleon. What the? Yep. Arcleon has I think got comes the right arm. And we gotta close everything up except that one, I think. I remember. Because we watched the video. And then there's a tab right there to pull out. And then tuck the head in for Arcleon. I think we also make him look like he's sitting like a good boy. I don't think you Oh yeah. Like that. You having troubles? And we 
leave that one out. Mm-hmm. And then leave that one out. Because that is one wing. And arm. Yep. I want to put it on. It looks like... And now, for Titan King... We do the same exact thing. And Eevee! And Eevee! Also, Baku Kitten. And I'm gonna hold Derpy. Call him Derpy. Okay. And... There's feet, the thumbs. Mm -hmm. Can I put arms on? If you want to put the arms on already, go for it, bud. Because I've been waiting for a pet to long. Okay, and now, Montrepod. Gotta get the feet. Tuck in Montrepod's head like that. That's Montrepod. Mm-hmm. Well, I can make him have his fist. He's got bones. There's one leg. Yeah, and I and we have to have the waist. That's what I call the waist. Got the waist. Okay, arachnia. Oh, okay. I see how that one goes. Because it's the waist. And then that one there. Because right there is going to be the tail. Mm-hmm. And then... For the next leg, we have Talon right here. This leg looks so cool, though. Okay. Talon. And now... Mm-hmm. The Weast.
All right, and stings her for the tail. Hi, I made it go in. Is it right there? Mm hmm. And we are almost done. It's just one last piece. And, and boom. Boom. Oh, you put the arms on a little bit weird. Yeah. Yeah, you put the arms on real weird, bud. Oh, it's supposed to go like that. Mm-hmm. There we go. And now we put on the lead, the tail and leaves. Oh, <laughs> even though he looks derpy with that. And well, now he looks a lot better. Yeah. Now he actually looks the way he should. And there is Geoforge Dragonoid Complete Transformation. Looking so awesome. And I want to have his fists. Right. His fists. And because he also got to do the dome. Mm -hmm. dome. Well, that's as good as you can get them for right now, but I like how this looks. Just large and in charge. And also he's supposed to have this as mm -hmm. his shoulder blades. Yeah. This, this is a really awesome, awesome Dragonoid. I am so glad that Baku Kid and I we're able to pick this up because wow, this just this is so awesome for our collection. Yeah. And it looks so good. And also you can just take it off whenever you want to. Mm-hmm. You can also put that in to make them look weird with it. Yeah. So that would be funny. It would be weird. It would be weirder if you could close them like with that. <laughs> that would be weird. Like, you would have a huge thing. Now. Wait, I know what would be funny. He got a big tail. Now, a lot of them already are closed. Well, now there is Arachnia closed up. Someone broke through my armor. My gum clothes. Okay, there's Titan King. There is Arcleon. Can you close this guy? Which one? This guy. Stingser? Yeah. Uh oh. There we go. Does he want close?
There's Talon. Carefully. Close them. There is Stingzer. And now for the last one. I might have to open Montrepod back up. And there is Montrepod and every single one. Bakugan. Every single Geogon with Dragonoid closed all the way back up. Yeah. That was actually fun to combine yeah. open. Well, actually close a lot of these was interesting. Because it was, for a couple of them, it was almost like, almost reverse engineering. It was weird. This, this is an interesting set, but I, I like it. It was, I think they, I think Spin Master designed this whole set pretty well. Even though they made it where if Dragonoid was having his mech head out, then he would look weird. But also... The people who made Bakugan, they made it to where it looked good on the uh, when he's in his, you know, form. But ah! that Scary. is going to wrap it up for this awesome Bakugan Video. Geoforge video dragonoid unboxing video we video. hope you guys did enjoy this if you did please go ahead and like uh also drop a comment letting us know what you guys think of this awesome bakugan set but until next video we are the baku boy signing off I'm baku Kid. and i am baku dad and always remember to stay awesome and nerdy let it rip and bakugan bra